gather here on this special day to join in happiness as you become husband and wife. Fifteen years ago you met. <laughs> it was not a case of love at first sight. In fact, you didn't particularly like each other. Because you had friends in common, you hung around together, and eventually, it seemed, you grew to tolerate each other, and even began to date. Not once, not once to rush into anything, you dated for several years before moving in together. Now over a decade later, You come before us to affirm your special relationship and to make public your commitment to each other to be of one family legally as well as spiritually and to declare your determination to journey through life together as husband and wife. hear our prayers to give Ted and Chrissy the special blessings that will enable them to live a long and happy life together and to provide a secure and loving home for their children and to abide by the vows they make today. Give them the strength to forgive when they falter, comfort when they sorrow, give support in times of need and companionship in times of joy. Ted and Chrissy, you will promise to love and honor each other. Strong marriage requires that each of you also, in your heart, vow to respect and support the integrity of the other. You must be able to laugh together and cry together. And know without question that in times of sorrow, each of you is a haven to the other. Honor each other in this way, and your love will continue to grow. The vows you are about to make are as sacred as any that can be made. They are the sacred affirmation of your mutual love and unity. They are the foundation upon which you will build your new life together. Make them sincerely and with your whole heart. <laughs> Ted, repeat after me. Hi, Ted David. Do take you, Chrissy Phillips, to be my wife, best friend, lover and confidant. I promise to love you and honor you, comfort you and hold you, for better or for worse, for richer or for poorer, in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, be faithful to you for all times. Take you, Ted, David. To be my husband, best friend, lover, and confidant. I promise to love you and honor you. Comfort you and hold you. For better or for worse. For richer or for poorer. Sickness and in health. Taking all others to be faithful to you for all time. Chrissy and Ted have exchanged vows before these gathered witnesses. As an enduring symbol of these vows, they will exchange wedding rings. These wedding bands, perfect circles of precious metal that have no beginning and Take this ring and place it on the finger of your bride as a token of your love and promises as you repeat after me. Okay. 
That's all right. Leave it there for holding your hand, man. I give you this ring as a pledge of my love and as a symbol of our unity. Chrissy, take this ring and place it on the finger of your groom as a token of your love and promise. I give you this ring as a pledge of my love and as a symbol of our union. May these rings be blessed as a symbol of this affectionate unity. Your two lives are now joined in one unbroken circle. Further symbol of uniting these two lives, Ed and Chrissy will perform the sand ceremony. These individual vials of sand These individual vials of sand represent your separate lives before today. I ask that each of you take one vial and together pour the sand into the single container. You will then shake the sand to combine the grains. of sand can never be separated into their individual colors, so too will your lives be in marriage. With joy in our hearts, we send you off with our deepest blessing. Let all others honor you in the sanctity of your home. May you find here a good beginning for sharing of many, many years. Chrissy and Ted, you have really chosen each other. Declared your love and pledged your commitment to each other in the presence of these witnesses. As a witness myself for God in the state of Florida, I now pronounce you husband and... Oh, wife.